Hello everyone, Mike Arnold here, co-founder of Pat Trading Partners along with Bob Iacchino. Uh, second divergence based off of this key low here. Sorry, this key low here. We do have double divergences setting up, so definitely waning momentum. You see it held the rotation zone going over the weekend, sold off, came down to 65.60, not yet to our major level of this about 6400, splitting the difference here is the next major level we're watching. And then rallied back to the rotation zone, just slightly closing above it right now. Updated the key retracement levels. I'm going to update some of these other levels right now also. We're going to come over here and see what we have here. So I'm taking some of these levels down with this bigger... Let's see. Let's update these coming in with this spike high coming in here all right we got those updated and i'm going to just update this with this big correction back to the rotation zone gives us an idea of what we're looking at so below 6560 we'd be watching for 6082 then 5600 to the upside, we already passed the 12 and a half percent retracement. We're trading at minor resistance right here, about 7,300 to 7,320. If we get through there, we'll start watching for 7,515 as the next key level based off the four hour chart. Out of the oversold condition pretty rapidly with this rally, but this thing got pretty oversold. Let's check the daily can see here the daily we've been selling off for quite a few days finally some reversal here but still deeply in oversold condition and you see it hasn't been this low back since uh may 16th or may 17th and then before that about may 12th so we're trading back at levels we haven't seen since the beginning of may we got overextended from the rotation zone same when we do that from the upside and we snap back not unexpected to do it from the downside. So this key resistance 75.15 is where the bottom of the rotation zone is on the four hour. This little also prior support becoming resistance. If we rally through there, we'll start watching for about 79.92. So essentially 8,000 and the top of the rotation zone. Switching over to Ethereum. Ethereum coming down also holding the rotation zone over the weekend. Trading lower, we had 131.82, finding some support right there. We have a divergence based off of this to this point and this to this point. So double divergence coming in and we get the snapback rally. Trading just below the rotation zone on a closing basis. And let's see, we need to update this. Our retracement levels, which I did not do yet. There we go. So above the 12.5%. So the next key level we'll be watching is about 156.20 to about 158. That's the next key level of resistance on the four hour. Next area lower, we're still going to leave it at 124.50. Switching over to daily chart on Ethereum. So you see also getting very overextended from the rotation zone, and this is a snapback rally. Key resistance at 156.20 is where the rotation zone is coming in with that 25% retracement and this little spike low. Getting through there, then we'd be watching for 168. 168.19 is the exact level, but we'll be really focused on the 168 with the top of the rotation zone. Still in oversold condition also. So those are all your key levels for Ethereum and Bitcoin, and we'll talk to everyone soon. Bye for now.